Cinderella stars Emma Stone in the titular role and tells the story or the origin story of Cruella de Vil and how she became the puppy skinner that we all know and love as a super villain. Um, when I first heard of this movie, I didn't know what to think. When I saw the trailers, I thought it looked pretty cool, it looked pretty fun. But later on, I thought about it. Why would Disney try to make a character that skins puppies somewhat redeemable? Or at least understandable? Because skinning puppies for their fur is not a very redeemable quality. Even though, though, you know what? There are no redeemable qualities about that in any way. Uh, Cruella is a fun villain movie about the origin story of a character we all know and love. But, in my opinion, the actual character herself and how she should be portrayed by the end... I don't think it felt earned. I think this is a well shot movie. It has a lot of flair and style to it. There's a bunch of uh, sets that remind me of the original movies and actually some colors and some other set designs that remind me of something of a weird out Tim Burton esque kind of film. Uh, Emma Stone is great. Emma Thompson is also really good. Their their rivalry with one another is actually pretty interesting and fun to watch. And I really like seeing how they banter off with each other. Um, then there is this heist element to the film. That times can be pretty likable. Um, but for the most part... This is a pretty forgettable movie, and in my opinion, it has to do with the actual character of Cruella herself. Her interactions with Emma Thompson is great, and Emma Stone is great in the role she's given, but I feel like as Cruella DeVille, when I watch the animated version, I don't see this version of Cruella DeVille becoming what we see in the animated movie. Now I know this is live action, but since it's supposed to take place in that same world, I don't think this movie did anything particularly well to justify this character becoming the villain we all know she would become. In my opinion, this movie, WoW was criticized for being like, a Joker ripoff in the trailers, I think it would have benefited a lot of inspiration from how Joker was handled. Because by the end of that film, as Jeremy said, if he's seen Jeremy John's reviews, and I agree with it, Joker by the end becomes the Joker we all know to be. He becomes a villain we're all familiar with. While with Cruella, I don't really see her becoming that same person. I think they missed the ball in the way they are able to conclude her character. Now, the style of the film, the soundtrack, which is a banger, uh, the performances were all great, the technical aspects were all really well handled, and the story can be fun at times, and I will say that at least for the most part, I did have an enjoyable time this movie. I wouldn't mind watching it again. But as a character piece for Cruella de Vil, and how this is another film in Disney's lineup of villains in which they take a popular villain and try to give her some depth and character development and make a movie around her. I think this worked a little better than Maleficent. But I don't think it was able to reach the heights I think it wanted to. And so for that reason, I'm going to give Cruella a B-. 
fun movie. I could watch it again. Performances and the style of the film were enough for me to enjoy it. But as a movie about Cruella Deville herself, I think they really missed the ball by the end. Anyway, guys, I think you'll enjoy it. But if you are like a hardcore Dalmatians fan, I don't think there's much for you here. Thank you guys so much for watching. People like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time.